Today, I'm going to show you the best mirror to use for a full-size mirror photo booth project. I'm going to outline the exact glass you'll need, how to frame it, and how to add touchscreen technology, then how to add lighting behind it. Jessica, mirror geek with two-way mirrors. Let's get started. It's very easy to build a mirror photo booth if you know how. The concept is simple. Combine a television, two-way mirror, and a touch frame. I'm going to take you step by step exactly what you'll need and how to put it together. A mirror photo booth can be any size and shape, but we made it to the same size as the touch frame to keep the project super simple. In this build, we use a 75 inch IR touch frame, which costs less than $350, along with the smart mirror glass. We've sandblasted the edges to provide lighting, which costs less than $35. For your convenience, I'll leave all the links in the description below. By the way, hit subscribe so that you are notified when we release a video of our amazing photo booth builds. I've already planned my next three mirror photo booth projects and I am so excited to share them with you. Unlike a regular two-way mirror, a photo booth mirror is highly transparent, allowing vivid color to pass through. The overall size of the mirror is built for a 75 inch diagonal IR touch frame, which plugs in with a USB into any PC. Now, I'm gonna take you through all the features that I'm really jazzed about. Tempering the glass makes it 10 times stronger, which makes it way less likely to break when transporting it. For the photo booth safety, it's definitely recommended. It's especially important if you plan on moving the photo booth around a lot or if you're traveling with it. Because if you show up with a broken photo booth, it could ruin your reputation and spoil the entire event. Sandblasted edges for backlighting. This allows you to add lighting directly into the booth. The light chasing LEDs behind it gives it a wow effect that screams, play with me. The light strip controller syncs to music with a microphone and can be fully controlled and programmed with your cell phone. Here's the extra equipment that comes in handy. A high power lithium power pack so the TV doesn't need to be plugged into a wall. A mini lithium battery pack for the 12 volt LEDs an extra long two-prong TV cord just in case you happen to be near an outlet, gaffer tape to keep it attached to the carpet and to prevent tripping, extra 12-volt LED light strips with white LEDs in case your client prefers it over the color chasing effect, a picture frame. I'll leave the link below so you can learn how to build a frame for it, or just check out our website for ordering. Here's a few more pro tips for you. Place any television behind it, ranging from 32 to 65 inches. Simply place your camera behind the glass on its own tripod. Each piece is lightweight. Frame, glass, and touch overlay easily placed together. We can customize the frame to any style that you would like. I'm now going to place the IR touch over the glass to transform it into a touch screen. Once the IR touch is plugged in, I will use the IR Calibration Touch service app to calibrate the screen. Once you have it calibrated, start up your photo booth app and take some pictures. Because the mirror is full scale, it does not need to lean a lot for people to see their full reflection in it. But if this is not your style, you also have the option to wall mount it or use a flight case. Prefer to have us make you a full system? Fully assembled units are available. We're happy to quote you a price based on your specs. It's also an in-stock item that can be shipped right away. Okay guys, that takes you through it. Any questions? Leave me a comment below and check out our website, twowaymirrors.com. Want to stay in touch with my latest projects? Hit that subscribe button and notification bell right now so you don't miss it. Well, that's all for now. I'm Jessica with Two Way Mirrors and I'll see you next time.